Bowman here from BW1, and just how fast are the network speeds on the Nintendo Switch? Well, after doing some testing, the results are pretty interesting, and hopefully this will help you here get the fastest speeds possible when using your Nintendo Switch. In this testing, I've done on 2.4 gigahertz, 5 gigahertz, and wired connection as well too. So let's first start off here with 2.4 gigahertz, the most common connection that most of us will connect with. After doing the test connection for speed here, you'll see that on 2.4 gigahertz, you only get nine down and about two megabits up. That's relatively slow considering my connection is 175, 180 megabits or so on a download and about 25 on the upload. So you're really not getting a lot of speed here on 2.4. And this is the most common that most people connect to. So that's something to definitely be aware of. But a lot of routers these days do have a five gigahertz connection. So let's go ahead and do the testing here on the five gigahertz network. And as you can see here, with using five gigahertz, we got 55 down and 15 up. Much better, much faster speeds. Should be fast enough speeds for downloading games and playing online. This is definitely what you want in terms of playing on your Nintendo Switch. Now let's take a look if you decide to dock it and you wanna play on a wired connection, you can use a USB adapter, it just has to be USB 3.0. And what's interesting here is I tested three of these here, but it seems like the ones that don't have extra USB ports on them are the ones that work with the Nintendo Switch. The one I have here is a few years old, it's from Utex Smart. I'll leave a link in the description of this one, the latest version of it, and other ones that I believe that will work with the Nintendo Switch. I'll need to do a little bit more further testing, but I'll give my best guess on which ones will work for you and leave those links in the description for you to grab one if you're looking for it. Now let's take a look at the speeds that you're gonna get here with the wire connection. Now, of course, with wired, you're gonna get faster, and this is really close to what my internet speeds are with you get about 105 down and about 15 up. So that's what I would expect with wired, and that should be the fastest in most cases. Definitely when you're docking, you probably, when you're playing online, you probably want to use a wired connection to be able to get the best speeds possible. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Ryan Chu, who's definitely helped us out in a couple of videos, our PS4 unboxing, and also our PS4 versus Xbox One versus Wii U video. He was actually the one that sort of dropped me a tip here about checking out the network speeds on Nintendo Switch, because he actually found some pretty interesting results as well, too. So not only he is a big gamer, he's also a big poker player and blogs about his poker. It's at his website called Dedicated to the Grind. You can check out all those articles there if you're into poker at all. He has some pretty cool stuff, and I'm learning some, learning some things as well, kind of reading his reading his uh, stories on about his poker journey here. So definitely check him out at dedicatedtothegrind.com. But this is your network speed test for the Nintendo Switch. And as you can see here, pretty interesting results. Hopefully some software updates may be able to increase the speed on the 2.4 gigahertz line uh, specifically. But as you can see here, you can see what you need to do to get the most optimal speeds available. So this is Bowman here from BW1. Thanks for watching. Check out all our other Nintendo Switch coverage. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube page here. And always remember to live your tech world in high definition.